with Cappy Joe, aka Overly, and in today's video, I am coming at you guys with a top five best night filters in NBA 2K20, my team. But before we get the video started, I want to ask you if you guys could please like, comment, and subscribe, because it will be greatly appreciated. And we are gonna be doing a giveaway at 1K subs. But put that aside, and the first, let's get right into the video. The first snipe filter is gonna be the galaxy opal filter now this filter works with any position that you guys want if you guys want to add the, the card to the squad or if you guys just are looking to make profit now you guys are going to put color galaxy opal and um max maximum buyout 100k now this works uh for any position as i just said you could put center you could try to snipe a yao ming you put you put the uh you put the minimum buyout at 500 and you move the minimum bid up 50 every time and this filter does work uh, for any position as I just said and if you guys are looking for a higher reward although it is higher risk you guys could just put all sometimes Trey Young and uh, Alex Caruso and those 100k players will pop up but you guys are just gonna have to try to like skip over them or if you have the cards bought you go down here and you enable the um, enable the setting that says exclude owner I mean exclude user own cards and you know you guys will be set now this filter uh, you're gonna want to put pink diamond as the color put the point guard as the position and um, move all the way over to glitch okay so glitch after that you guys want to go to the maximum buyout and put it at 100k uh, put the minimum buyout at 500 and move the maximum bid move the minimum bid up 50 every time now this uh, this filter you guys are looking for uh, pink diamond point guard Nikola Jokic um, Giannis uh, and LeBron James so this filter is low key a W for you guys for you guys that want to add a glitch point guard to your squad but this this filter is very rare uh due to the fact that the, those cards aren't impacted that much but people are going to be throwing up cards today just because tomorrow is going to be a uh, spotlight sim cards and everybody's panicking and selling i already did see dbg's video so that's why uh that's why I suggest you guys use these snipe filters. Now, for the next filter, you guys are gonna want to put the buyout at 500, the maximum buyout 500, or you could put it to 600. Put the minimum buyout at 500 and put the max and move the maximum bid up 50 every time. Now, this filter is oh, wow. I missed that. I was super slow because I'm trying to talk to you guys, but this filter does have a lot of competition just because you can get literally any card you can get opals out of this filter you can get pink diamonds out of this filter and you could get literally any color type of card any card uh, out of this filter now i do suggest you guys put 550 uh, but either way you guys are going to be making profit off of those off of these bronzes that i keep missing i'm telling you guys it's, it's a lot of competition on this filter but you guys are going to be making profit on any type of card that you get out of this filter which is why it is one of the best filters and honestly for you budget people out there this is the best filter next filter we are going to put the color to heat check now for those of you that were in my stream the other day you guys do know that this is the best filter in the game in my opinion the most consistent filter in the game in my opinion honestly you guys can make profit off this filter every time because people just throw up these cards not knowing what their value is but this filter is like it's just very consistent you guys the cheapest the cheapest heat check is not even yeah, it's not even close to 1900 it's gonna be like 2 2k not e it's not even 2k so the filter so the uh, the heat check cards are aren't really are really rare, and people just throw up. Why is it because I have this? 
this is why this heat this filter is just so good now they they went up to 3k um i think it's because the is other packs going on let me check they do it every playoff every time playoff comes so yeah the packs are gone so the the filter is gonna get better okay so the next filter on the list is the diamond filter now this filter is uh you put the color to diamond obviously and you move the maximum buyout to 3350 3, put the minimum buyout to 500 and just move the maximum bid over uh, 3000 and honestly this this filter has worked a lot for me especially when i was a budget baller and didn't have not one opal on my squad the filter has always been good for me yeah, and this I feel like it's the it's the most consistent due to the fact that it has the least value. Like it, it's not that it's not that much cards that um, go for that much on this filter. But you guys are making profit on anything you get out of this filter. You guys can get the best diamonds to the most common diamonds, which is why it's number five on the sniper list. Alright, so that was the video. If you guys did like, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. Um, my next video will be posted around tomorrow. If not today, later today. We'll try to do a double upload for you guys. But if not, make sure you guys uh, stick around in my stream because I will be streaming. But tell me which uh, card, what cards you want to see in my lineup. And what cards you want to see out of my lineup. What cards you think are going to come out tomorrow. Or just, you know interact with me in the comment section so yeah make sure you guys follow my twitch and my twitter to stay updated on what i'm gonna post and yeah that was the video